Mm-hmm. Then he was fired, right? Fired or, or released or something, but he was collecting money. CM Punk has made his return to WWE. Oh my God. Are you a wrestling fan? Are you a big wrestling fan? Do you care about CM Punk? Nope, but I do. I did like Stone Cold and I liked uh, Kane and the music back in the day. Those Undertaker, all that shit was really dark and creepy and I loved it. And uh, I haven't watched it since then, obviously. So. so CM Punk was in the WWE, I think till 2013, about a decade ago. And he left on really, really, really bad terms. He came out and he was really public about how much he hated WWE, how they screwed up. It. They weren't there for him medically. They they uh, continued to push him and he had to wrestle over and over again. So much so that he left and then he went to UFC and he signed a deal with UFC. And so much so that he sucked at fighting in real life. He's a good fake fighter, but a bad real fighter. So he fought on UFC, immediately got bounced because he lost both of his fights like horribly. Uh, then he just kind of sat there and he collected money until AEW came around a couple of years ago. And AEW was a startup wrestling uh, federation, which is now the big number two behind WWF. But uh, like, uh, like, make no mistake, it is a distant number two behind WWE, uh, a massive number two. But when he came on to AEW, it was a really big deal. And it was a very big viral moment. And uh, it was like CM Punk is back. And he, he, he had said many times he's never going to wrestle again. He's done until he wasn't. right. And uh, he had a really, really crazy couple of years of AEW where he was uh, the golden boy. He was the champion. And then he got in trouble. And then he was suspended. And then he came back for a short amount of time after like a year. And uh, then he like got in a real life fight backstage. And he threatened to kill somebody or something. Mm-hmm. And then he was fired right? Fired or or released or something, but he was collecting money. So that's been that way for a few months. And WWE had a big event over the weekend called Survivor Series, where right as the show is about to finish, the Survivor Series match is done. And then all of a sudden, his music hits. It's cult of personality, right? And everyone's like, oh my gosh. And you get about two minutes of CM Punk standing at the top of the ramp, and you want to talk about, about a viral moment. This thing was crazy viral. 87 million views Jesus. in 24 hours, which is crazy. Now, it is, it's, it's kind of unbelievable how popular wrestling is. It's crazy. Like, yes. Fucking crazy. Now, he is a, um, he's been around for a long time. CM Punk is now 45 years old. Right. He's not a, he's not like the old spring chicken anymore and he's still out there fighting, but he's still collecting major, major money. Uh, he is he got a pop. You know, that's what they call when the audience goes crazy. Like, you know, very few wrestlers can receive just based off of the surprise of him returning. Plus, I believe the pay-per-view took place in Chicago, which is where CM Punk hails from. You, as somebody who has never, who are like, who used to watch Stone Cold and Kane, does this get you excited at all? There was a uh, tweet that was put out by Triple H, who is like the chief creative guy now. He's like the Vince, Mc, the new Vince McMahon, and uh, Vince McMahon's uh, like fa- uh, son-in-law. Um, he put out a tweet saying it was like a cold day in hell because nobody ever thought that this would happen, and sure enough, it has happened. So. I guess we'll have to wait and see kind of what happens. But uh, there's a lot of new money in WWE, specifically from Saudi Arabia. And, you know, the the Saudis have a lot of money over there. And people will get paid millions of dollars just to have a single match. So anyways, Phil Brooks, otherwise known as CM Punk, is back in WWE. And uh, apparently he's going to be on the Raw brand. So we'll be watching on Monday night. But what do you think about this? Leave us a comment down below. We read every single one of them. Also, make sure you hit the subscribe button because you have found your home for common sense in the gaming and entertainment worlds.